In July of 1637, Miguel Pellicer was working on his uncle's farm. He was sitting on the back of a mule that was pulling a cart when he fell asleep. The He slipped out of the saddle and the cart ran over his right leg, breaking his tibia. He was rushed to the hospital in Valencia, but after five days, he decided he wanted to go to Our Lady of the Pillar in Zaragoza. The journey took 50 days, and by the time he arrived, his leg was so rotted, there was no way he would recover. Surgeons had no choice but to amputate. They cut off his leg just below the knee. Pellicer decided to remain in Zaragoza so he could continue to pray to Our Lady of the Pillar. In his visits to the sanctuary, he would ask for a small amount of the oil they used to light their lamps. Every night, he would rub that oil onto his leg, massaging the stump and praying. Finally, after two years, his family convinced him to return home. Just weeks after returning home, he woke from his sleep. His parents stood over him, tears of joy streaming down their cheeks. As he had laid there dreaming of that blessed oil from Our Lady the Pillar, his leg grew back. This is the miracle of Kalanda.